Today we're in Green Swamp East Hampton Track here in Polk County. We're out here with the USDA and we're releasing biocontrol agents for the Old World Climbing Fern, which is a highly invasive plant that we are working to help control on district lands. My name is Jacqueline Bellello and I'm the Invasive Plant Management Biologist here at the district. Biocontrol is a way of controlling an invasive plant by using their own natural enemies that will only eat the target plant. We are releasing about 600,000 ligodium mites. Its scientific name is Floracaris parapi, and then about 50,000 brown ligodium moth caterpillars. Its scientific name is Neomusatima conspercatalis. I'm Melissa Smith. I'm a research ecologist from the Invasive Plant Research Lab, which is a USDA lab that focuses on biological control of invasive plants, and we're located in Davie, Florida. USDA is the U.S. Department of Agriculture. An effective and cost-effective way to control invasive species is using their natural enemies. So things that normally eat and consume them and are specialists. So what we've got today are two specialists, so organisms that co-evolved with Old World Climbing Fern and can only use this species as their main source of nutrients. We rely on our partners and cooperators who manage lands that are impacted by invasive species, particularly old world climbing fern, in order to make this research relevant. One of the nice things that the district has been able to do is to support the USDA's efforts in biocontrol. We've had this excellent working relationship with the district and that allows us to really understand the plant and insect. Old World Climbing Fern is one of the most challenging invasive species that we deal with here just because of where it likes to live and how hard it is to get to, to control. Having this biocontrol agent be able to help to reduce these populations would be of tremendous benefit as far as staff time and money and just the health of the district lands.